Uh, Christine, you you want to talk about our Twitter poll that we put out? Oh yeah. Speaking of the uh, the two people who seem to have a lot in common, a lot. I asked our our Twitter audience if they thought that the two of them should either date. Or be related, because they seem like two people who would Ooh. either be very related, like compatible cousins who have the same drive, or if they're so compatible, they should be like they should just get should together. Totes hook up, yeah. <laughs> and get together one hundred percent. One, I mean, it wasn't one hundred percent, but across the board, was, most yeah. people thought that they would be a uh, very perfect I, 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 I couple. Like Hang on, I'm gonna try to find like the, the results of here. Them being friendly rivals, and they just kind of cross paths, going after the same treasure, but then team up at times, but then at other times are just heated enemies. No, but when they yeah. but that's the one thing. Of them stab the other in the back. No, that's no, no, no. But that's they the both thing. They kind of wear the same clothes. Yeah, too. They, do, yeah. <laughs> they do. the <laughs> literally yeah. the exact same. And they go off on all these amazing all the adventures. Yeah, they, they have the same tailor, basically. <laughs> that's right. Yeah. The same, the same White shirt or store beige tank top, beige t-shirt. You know. So oh, hey, we had. I'll see you at the mall later. Today. Oh, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> hey, Cruz, Ooh, have that I know how much you just, spent on that. They, yeah, they just go to the store where all the archaeologists go and they buy their clothes there. That's right. Because they're in, all in, shopping. Indy's the store there. manager. Yeah, 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 Indy's, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Indy's the owner of the shop. Yeah. He's the old owner of the he's shop. He's retired now. That's what he's yeah. doing. He just sells it. Hung up his whip. So we, had, you put out the poll, Christine. We had 16 votes. 75 percent said they should date. 25 percent they said they should be related. Uh, but we had some tweets that answered back. So JC Tango wrote, "The world is not ready for their progeny." Tom Baker wrote, "Tom Baker wrote, where's the arm wrestle option?" Which I thought was great. <laughs> yeah. uh, Danielle wrote, uh, "Option three: star in a musical together." Which I I would watch that. I, I would watch, watch that too. I would watch that. Uh, and then, charting the tomb, a musical. <laughs> That's <Yeah. right. laughs> And then uh, somebody else wrote in saying that Nathan Drake's already married, which I was like, oh. That doesn't matter. So you can be compatible world. with somebody else. Yeah, I'm going to go and live in a fantasy world. That doesn't matter. It's a hypothetical. <laughs> well, okay, let's go around the table. What do you think? If you had to pick between date and related, what would you want for Nathan Drake and Laura Croft? Uh, date? Just uh, just because uh, for the, the idea of the idea of Nathan Drake may, may, maybe becoming estranged with his wife and, and then marrying Laura Croft and then creating the greatest archaeologist the world's ever seen. That's true. Christine? Like I like them dating. I think it's fun to have two people who are so alike, but they would have such a competitive spirit to each mm. other where they would both be like, okay, honey, we're fine, and then they'd run off and do their Mr. own separate adventures. Kind yeah. of a Mr. Yeah. and Mrs. Yeah. Smith situation. Speaking of breaking up relationships, Colin? Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not ready to live in a world of them dating, so they're related because the internet would not be able to handle it. Um, <laughs> but yeah, just you know, just them being related and maybe crossing paths and saying like, "Oh, hey, cousin, what's going on?" And then it'd be like, "Oh mm. my god!" Could you imagine so cool. the stories of that family dinner table? Yeah. yeah. Oh great. my god. Exactly. Oh, they'd have to date. <laughs> they have it. to date. Yeah. Oh yeah. Even even when even if if it was something like when Steve had said they were like rivals, like there'd be so much sexual tension that eventually they'd have to hook up anyway. It'd be like any <laughs> Hollywood film that has ever been made. They no, they have to date. So maybe they, they should be like related and then have that happen. Ah. Mm. Wow. Yeah. Wow. No. <laughs> You're going way too Game of Thrones. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I personally think that they should be related. That that would be my Thank choice. Thank you, Roman. I, I think it would be great if you had a game where like there was like you know Uncharted Raider where like they find out that they're both going after the same thing and then they end up there and then they find out that their dad like you know had a previous relationship or something and that their brother and sister or their half brother and sister but or before their cousins. that there was that sexual tension it's Luke it's and the oh my god <laughs> They have that sexual uh, sexual tension, and it's like when Marty kisses his mom in the car, and they're like, eh, "It sounds weird. Right. Yeah. 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 We need to stamp a TM on this storyline yeah. right now. Like, <laughs> someone's gonna write something." I got so much fanfic yeah. going through yeah. my head right in, now. In two oh, years, this movie's gonna this, this, this movie's gonna be announced. Waiting to happen. Yeah, <laughs> this movie's <laughs> going to be announced in two years, <laughs> and we're all gonna we're all gonna meet up and sit around a table and and. And call each other idiots at the same time <laughs> because we didn't cash in on this. Now we weren't on like some cruise ship in the Mediterranean because we have so much cash. We're just like floating in it because everyone would love this story, right? That'd be the greatest. Uh, you know what? We should actually make that happen. Just write some fan fiction about Laura Croft, and I, I like that idea. Just bring it to E3 and be like, "Look, look what we did." Yeah, yeah. I like the idea. It was us. Our yeah. idea. Just, I like TM, the idea. TM, 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 TM. Yeah, I like the idea of them going, having the sexual tension, wanting to hook up, and then suddenly. Realizing they're related. 
See, that and then creeps me out Luke all over the board. It. That just <laughs> creeps me out every which way but Tuesday. I think it really works in Star Wars because of the era that Star Wars is yeah. in. Like nowadays, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. that would happen. Be like, oh my god, no, please, no. Yeah. Yeah. Star Wars coming out in a month. So, Do you think more of that's going to happen? <laughs> <laughs> they might go back to it. You know, well, it's it's such a messed up Luke and Leia. Just yeah. like, remember that time that we like, kissed? Remember that time stuff? we kissed? Yeah. 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 Uh, so Robot Chicken made Robot Chicken Star Wars. Uh, they made a couple of uh, Robot Chicken Star Wars uh, episodes. And my favorite one is like a Jesus three second Christ. clip where Luke and Leia are lying in bed together. And Leia just looks at Luke's like, that was so wrong. <laughs> <laughs> that was the best moment there. That's so wrong. All right, Twitter, tell us what you think. Uh, tweet us back. <laughs> what do you think of our brilliant idea for a script? Let's go with it. How but, sick do you think we are right now? Do you now? like being related and sexual tension? <laughs> uh, we, we, we should do a Twitter poll. Uh, uh, is this idea the best? Yes or you're Please. damn right it is. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't think we can go on after that. No, I think, that, I think this is, this is it. This yeah. is how you end the that's story. The end of the show.